Echo, turn on my studio. Okay. All right, y'all. I know it's been a while. I know I'm late. I've been gone for a while, but I got some stuff that came in the mail that I'm really excited about, and um, it's going to make it easier for me to vlog more and uh, kind of get my head back in the game. So, wait. Got stuff from Amazon. I just got the uh, Rode Video Mic, mic Me for um, cell phones. Um, just came in today, so I'm going to test it out and see how it sounds. This is uh, how audio sounds without the Rode Video Mic Me uh, microphone plugged in. And this is what it sounds like with it. Hold on. And this is what it sounds like with the microphone. This is the Rode uh, Video Mic Me. I'm recording from a uh, Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. I always had decent video quality, but always really poor audio. Oh, I mean, not really poor, but just not that great. Um, I'm gonna add a. Uh, I'm gonna add a uh, dead cat filter onto it. It came with the the whole pack. It came with the microphone, so I'm gonna add that right now. Hold on. And this is what it sounds like when you have the dead cat filter. I'm not really sure what that, um, what difference that makes until I can take uh, the video and review it for myself. So let me know what you guys think. Uh, let me know in the comments below if this audio is better than the audio from the, uh, the previous video or the previous uh, audio in the beginning of the video. So I just played, played the audio back, and this mic is pretty dope. Like, I didn't expect that big of a change to come from this little bitty microphone right here, man. This is uh, this is pretty, pretty decent audio coming from a, a small directional mic. Cuts out all the, uh, the white noise in the background. All it's getting is whatever it's pointing at at the time. I think that that is pretty dope, and it's got this little uh, adapter here that goes on the back of the microphone if I can get it off hold on goes on the back of the microphone so that it'll hold it in place so you have decent um you have decent um security when you plug it into the whatever device you're plugging it into S cell phone or iPhone or Android or whatever so this is the audio from straight from the G Samsung Galaxy Edge the S S7 Edge and this is um this is the audio from the road mic hold on road mic s7 edge road mic is like winning right now dude i don't know if y'all can hear me adjusting it but i'm trying to clip it back onto the uh back onto the phone this is gonna make it 10 times easier to vlog i got some other stuff that came in the mail today and i'm gonna do a review on that um, but this, uh, this might change the game. All right, one more time. With the road mic, without the road mic. I don't know if I can do that, uh, if I just messed up the video or not. But this is, um, the audio. Samsung 7 Edge, S7 Edge, Galaxy S7 Edge audio. And this is the road video mic me. What in the world? Like crazy difference, crazy difference. All right, so this is the audio for with the uh, with the dead cat on. Um, I'm not really hearing too much of a difference because um, I'm not really in a windy area. So uh, I guess once I experience some wind, uh, I guess I'll start to hear the difference. But um, this is amazing, man. I I never would have guessed that this would have made this big of a difference in my uh, in my audio. But uh, I am highly impressed. Oh, there's some wind. I'm highly impressed with the audio results that I just got from this, and uh, I think I'm gonna keep it. 
Okay, so the next thing that I got from Amazon is a uh, it's a video light. Um, it's a LED small compact video light that goes on the top of your camera or actually wherever you set it. Um, so let's, let's check that out. It comes in this little pouch. It's by Aperture. And this thing is tiny. This is way smaller than what I expected. Hopefully it's bright enough to even uh, light up what I need to light up for my vlogs and, and whatever else I need it for. Oh, it is kind of bright. I think it has like, um, geez, this bright. Look at that. I think it has like nine or ten different settings. Yo, that's crazy. Can you see that? Can y'all see that? Even in daylight, that's 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 pretty bright. That's that's kind of bright. Okay, so this thing is really tiny really small it's not even like <laughs> size of my hand what's even dope about this is that it comes with its own like little high shoe mount and what you do is just slide this part up in here into this little lip you screw this back piece out slide this in here like that back in that thing's not going anywhere whatever you want to use this for is bro yo this, this lit me up in the daylight I have to try to put the links in the description for the uh, products that I'm showing here today. If I don't, just hit me in the comments and I'll uh, try to repost it or update the subscri uh, this description. But now that I have these things, it should make vlogging a lot easier, right? Wrong. A lot of the times I don't really um, post my videos or post my uh, vlogs. I don't really know why, to be honest with you. I record a lot and then I just don't post it. I'm not too good at this. A lot of the times uh, I don't really vlog because I feel like I don't have enough. I, did, I never have enough gear or I never have enough material or I never have enough this or never have enough that. And re in reality, I think it's a lot of just procrastinating and making excuses. A lot of my videos will end up um, being saved to a, like a external hard drive. I have a terabyte hard drive that I save my videos to. And I don't really, uh, I don't really revisit them after I save them to that hard drive. Memories and home videos, adventure vlogs, and stuff like that. I started these YouTube videos because of like this concept to where I wanted to gauge how much I was improving. Look at this. This is this is a pure example of how much I procrastinate. I was supposed to chop this brush down and bundle it up and put it out front so that um, the garbage people can take it. Didn't happen. Um, what am I, what was I saying? I forgot what I was saying. I need like a script or something. Vlogging is not an easy, like, if anybody ever told you vlogging was easy, they lied. You ever wanna Google yourself? Like, I started doing vlogs to keep track of my progress. You know, like daily progress or weekly progress or whatever. Facebook does this thing that um, they show you what you were doing this day a year ago or five years ago or whenever you post and I thought it would be really cool to use the concept of wanting to Google myself and find out <laughs> answers about me that I may have forgotten uh, so this vlog is definitely gonna be a challenge for me because I don't feel like editing all the time I don't feel like uploading I don't feel like actually talking to a camera. Um, so I'll try to do better. And uh, if you guys like the results that I posted for the microphone, and I'll have some more um, details on my, my vlogging equipment and my vlogging setup um, in the near future. So um, yeah, if you could, uh, Hit that like and subscribe button and comment in the links below. That will be dope. This is Brandon Rico signing off. See you later.